Hello everyone, welcome to this new set of tutorial about RStudio. Let's load the RStudio. So as you can see I have the R version 3.1. I hope even you have the same version and you can see the R tool is used for statistical computing. That's a wonderful st software for statistical analysis and, and uh, to create model and prediction and etc etc. So yeah I already have a pre table that is loaded a preloaded table which I will not be needing it so I'm just going to clear it. So let's begin from beginning. Yeah. Let's click over here and click on our script. It opens a new file. Now let's start. Let's start some coding. So in our studio, most of the code will look like Python. So uh, you might recollect that it is almost it is almost same as Python in terms of code. So it's not going to be that difficult to um, catch up on. So let's create a variable again, just like we did in Python. So let's create a variable called data, which to which we'll assign the um, the the file the data file that I have in my computer I'm going to import it and assign it to the name data so so you need to uh, write a less than symbol and then followed by a minus symbol so it should look like an arrow so the arrow towards data represents whatever the next thing will come that will be a value assigned to this variable so you don't use is equal to symbol over here so let's write read dot csv so we are saying that we need to read a csv file open parenthesis file dot choose and then we are saying that let's choose a file within our computer and run it there you go a tab opens here I am going to load users dot csv and you can see over here so whatever that you write over here it, it is going to be implemented over here it's going to run over here so this is like a console this is like an interpreter and this is like the uh, storage file view so this is this is the wonderful part you have all separated in four categories yeah here you can write your entire coding part here it will be implemented and here you can see all the graphs and solutions and plots and here you can see all the data so yeah when we wrote this and we uh, imported a data here this is where the data comes and when you click on it you can see all the data that I have so I have all the data related to a whatever that is there in the file set so yeah so this is what is the code that we use to import the file Hope you found this tutorial interesting and I'll be putting more on RStudio and it's, it's a pretty good tool to learn and, and do a lot with it. So thank